Hey guys, welcome back. Thanks for checking out my video today. We are going to be unboxing the April 2018 Boxy Charm. Um, I got this in the mail a few days ago, but things have been so crazy that I haven't had a chance to film this for you. I did take a little bit of a sneak peek and they have made some changes to BoxyCharm. So let's look at those together. The first big change is now instead of a postcard, we have this little brochure. They put the coupons on the back. I have version two. Um, and then you open it up. It has a theme, eye candy. We have some of the boxy babes right there. And then all of our product listings on the inside. So, let's just dig in. Sorry for my face today, guys. I have barely any makeup on. It has been a very long day. Um, I just started a new journey for fitness and health. Um, I am working with nine round boxing and fitness. Um, doing a six week challenge. So it's intense workouts and fitness. Uh, intense workouts and um, nutrition. So um, I'll be filming some updates for you guys here. The goal is to lose 25 pounds and or 6% body fat. So if you're interested in letting interested in how my journey goes or knowing kind of what I'm doing, I suck at motivation guys. So this is the perfect opportunity for me. Um, I have someone holding me accountable. So that's great. And, um, you all can hold me accountable as well, but if you have any questions, we can learn through this together, and I'll be happy to share my information with you. Now, back to your regularly scheduled programming. Boxy Charm. This is our box this month. And I'm going to be honest with you, this is the only box that I've seen anyone unbox. I don't know if they said there's a bunch of variants, and everybody just got this one box, or what. But... Let's just start with it here, okay? So the first thing I pull on the box is the Brow Gal um, Tanya Crooks Instant Brow Hair. Um, it's in shade 02, I guess is what it... Yeah, shade 02. Tinted Brow Gel with Microfibers. So we see that there. See, I think it says... Right here, 02. I think that's our shade. Um, so this retails for $22, tinted eyebrow gel with microfibers to achieve a natural hair look, perfect for the customer who wants a quick but natural fill to their brows. So I would try this out, I normally use an Essence um, brow gel, it's um, just kind of a dark taupe is the color that I use, and it works really well, um, I think, but I will compare this to it and let you know how that works out for us. The next thing we have is the Dr. Brandt's Pores No More Vacuum Cleaner Pore Purifying Mask. So we know what this is about. We all love Dr. Brandt's. I love getting it in my box. We've got the microdermabrasion scrub a couple times or two different versions of it or something. Um, but it's amazing so I'm always happy to get that. That retails for $47. Um, and it's supposed to, it says this award-winning pore refining mask is an extraction specialist, unclogging and tightening the look of pores and reducing excess oil from the skin surface. So I love these kind of masks, especially like right across my nose. I have one of the ones, um, the like Korean market ones, um, you can't read anything on it, honestly, um. But you've seen the videos. You pull it off and people cry and scream because it hurts when you pull it off. It's really not that bad, y'all. It's really not that bad, but it does work wonderfully. So I'll try this one out and let you know how that uh, matches up. The next thing we have is this Adesi, I think is how you say it, um, High Definition Liquid Lipstick. Luxurious, creamy, long-wearing liquid lipstick provides a dazzling full coverage of a lipstick with the ease of wand applicator. Made with advanced polymers and intense pigments for lasting color. Brilliant 
long lasting, brilliant color and intense shine in a single sweep. Cruelty free, gluten free, paraben free, blah, blah, blah. This retails for $24. Um, so again, this does not have a shade name on it. Looks like this. I mean, it's pretty simple packaging. Um, it smells like kind of like licorice, but it's like a combination of vanilla and licorice. The doe foot is very weird. Um, I'll give you that. It's kind of like, look at this, guys. I mean, it, it feels kind of flimsy. Like when I was swatching it on my hand here for you, it feels kind of flimsy. Um, this is a brown color. Can you see that? There, that what's in the light. Um, it might be okay. I think we got a Galactic color like this not too long ago. Um, so I'll try it out and let you know. Right now I've got it on my hand. I want to see how it dries down on, and I'll let you know how quickly it dries down. If it dries down completely matte, if it transfers, or how that goes. Till then, moving on. This one I'm kind of excited about. I haven't gotten a chance to try this yet. It's the Tartiest uh, Pro Glow, and we got Shade Exposed. Again, I haven't seen anyone get any other shades than this, so I, I don't know. Um, it comes, I'm just opening it and going for it. Um, here's the packaging. Pretty simple. Looks like a lip gloss tube. So I'm just going to put a dot of it here, and it's kind of a goldy champagne color. And let's just see. It has a lot of micro glitter in it. No, it's actually, it doesn't come off on camera. There we go. Um, it's pretty subtle, um, but it does have a lot of micro glitter in it. So, um, if you don't like micro glitter, you're probably not going to like that, but it doesn't have as intense of a glow as I would hope for. So maybe this is more of a lit within glow product. Um, what does our book say about that? It's this tardiest pro glow liquid highlighter glow like a goddess with this creamy highlighter that builds from sheer to intense ultra concentrated pigments or and pearls are suspended in the hybrid gel cream oil free formula that you can mix with your liquid foundation or wear alone for naturally lit luminosity infused with rose water. It slips softly onto the skin and keeps moisture in with tapered squeezable package to put the highlight exactly where you want it. So it says this is buildable. This is dry on my hand now, so let's let's see if it's buildable. We're going to just put another dot the exact same amount. Let's just try this. I don't know if that looks any better to y'all or not. Can you see that now? Number one, that little dot goes a long way, so like it does just take a little bit of this product. And maybe it is buildable. There's just so much micro glitter in here, guys. I don't know if I would try to build it. My finger. Hey. It's pretty glowy. I don't know. I'll play with it. I'll let you know. Um, you might have to remind me in the the comment section. Sometimes I forget. The last thing in this palette is our ColourPop palette. The last thing in the box is the ColourPop palette. It's been a long day, y'all. I already told you. Um, we got the Golden State of Mind. And I have to say, I was so disappointed to get this one. I mean, I guess disappointed isn't the right word because I was hoping for the My Little Pony palette. I'm a big child. I know. But I really wanted that one. It had some colors that I would love to play with. Um... But, okay, um, honestly, I don't have any color pop shadows, so I'm, I'm okay with it. Um, so in this palette, we have no mirror. Um, and then these are our shadows here. They're all shimmer. And I've already tried to swatch a couple of them. I'm going to be honest with you. Um, they finger swatch okay, but they're chunky. And I'm just swatching some of them on my hand here for you. 
I'm not honestly as hard as I have to press with my hands with my fingers to get these to swatch on my hand I'm not sure how they're gonna wear on the eyes um, so we'll just have to see I think we're gonna have to do an update video for this box there's a few more um, they all come off very chunky and um, we're gonna play with it and I'll let you know maybe we can make it work I don't know um, but that is our ColourPop palette and it retails for $26. It says highly pigmented shadow that applies evenly and feels ultra velvety and silky. This long wearing formula contains a unique combination of softer powders which adhere easily to the eyes giving a soft focus effect and blend smoothly and evenly. I mean, they look good on my fingertips, but the swatches on my hand are not looking so great, y'all. We'll see. Update to come. That is all I have for you today, guys. Let me know if you got a different box. I'm so interested to see someone who has a different box because I have yet to see one. So let me know down in the comments. I'd love to come and see what you've gotten. I'd love to check out your video. Or you can just put pictures in so we can all share in the fun. Um, as always, go ahead and hit that like or subscribe button if you want to see any more of my videos. Leave me a comment if you have any questions or concerns, anything like that. Until next time, I will see you. Bye.